Climate change is a big threat to food systems in countries the world over, with gross impacts on food security and livelihoods, particularly for the poor and vulnerable. The Global Food Policy Report by the International Food Policy Research Institute being unveiled here is now trying to change this narrative. The findings of the report seek doubling of current levels of public investments in innovations to reach $15 billion for low- and medium-income countries. It as well six investments in research and development equivalent to 1% of agricultural output, which could improve food production by 3%. You'll find that the recommendations are of a, of a fairly broad nature, but when they are adopted at the national level, they can very quickly um, be implemented. So we really want to be proactive and say there are things that we can do today to address both climate change and, and mitigation. Other areas of suggested interventions are the provision of incentives alongside strengthening land tenure rights for individuals and communities. Centering actions in the context of the diverse communities in which we work and engaging local, marginalized, and underrepresented groups as critical agents of change. For Nigeria, the report is a call to action towards better food systems in the country amid efforts by the authorities towards agricultural development. The provision of research-based policy solutions that can sustainably reduce household poverty and address hunger and malnutrition frontally becomes even more important with the challenges posed by climate change. The Global Food Policy Report outlines a wide range of opportunities for accelerated action that should be a top priority in policy and investment decision making for climate change adaptation, mitigation and resilience. The report identifies that attaining suggested reforms by countries like Nigeria could be quite challenging, so it suggests streamlining various areas including finance and incentives and institutions in various contexts towards the attainment of said goals. Lara Folayo, TVC News, Abuja.